Yes, we are finally about to do it on the Monstrous Walker Show. And what, pray tell, might that be? We're going to go to the guessing game, Monstrous Walker's guessing game, or it's going to be guessing game related stuff that we're doing today. We're going to go through the long slog of taking the qualified bests, as they are called, down to the fifth place ribbon. Long, long, long process that we go through. Manual. And if there's a better way, please tell me, vast uh, listening audience, please tell me how, that I, how I can do this on my Excel, uh, Excel, 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 Excel. Spreadsheet, 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 spreadsheet. What we're going to do first is order the list by um, fewest hits because this ought to do something for us. There's some kind of glitch, I swear, that makes this not work as perfectly as I believe it ought to. We follow up small hits by largest shares. And um, for some reason, a guess which, let's see what, let's see the nature of it. Ten, here's my ten threes. Everything that has 10,300,000 adjusted right here. Or where's the raw hit? I think that's the key. Guesses with 10.2 million raw hits that are adjusted upward to 10.3 million come before. Now, this is interesting. Why a 10.1 would be down lower. But all the 10, everything at 10.3 that holds at 10.3 scores below everything at 10.2 now it's just it's not shaking out life why is the 10.1 below everything that's the craziest part of all to me some kind of glitch going on here anyways if I reorder this bunch by smallest hits We're going to at least get this part right. If I do it at this point, this partial batch. And now this by largest shares. This will get me what I want for these eight guesses. But I don't know about the stuff below that. The stuff below that seems to be falling into the right order. Um... Good God, is this even true? What do we have now? Right is it first? It's supposed to be life. Oh, come on, baby. Well, these are all, well, yeah. There's a different opinion about what is first in shares. Okay, never mind the W. That just messes us all up, up all over again. Excuse me. What we really need to do is do this by smallest, and then we'll be fine, because they're all tied in shares. Yes, okay, they're all tied in shares. And now we have smallest hits to the most, and that's going to help us for the qualified best. I, would act I actually prefer most hits to fewest um, when I'm doing when I'm uh, figuring out shares rank for breaking ties in shares rank I do like uh, uh, most hits first most hits is preferable but fewest is preferable for the qualified best because of how qualified bests are defined um, guesses that beat all others in either percentage or shares. So life beats everybody 
because it's at 21 point. Well, life is the most shares, period. Um, or of the guesses with the tithes most shares, it's one of the most highest percentage. So here it is on top. So everything else in the world, or 99.9.58 something, other things I do are automated. I do have this glitch with uh, tops and shares, which went through a little bit of a manual thinking process on. Um, but my qualified best is, is a totally automated or totally manual process. And I would like that to change. So vast listening audience, help me find a better way. Um, okay. We better get this down to a manageable size of some sort because we're going to bring up our we're going to bring up this puppy and we don't really need this stuff anymore or does, I suppose it doesn't really hurt us does it just do it this way okay we need to size our box size our box So far, so good, but there's going to be a time when I'm going to want more space than that. Okay. And where are we? Um, I think this is fine. So, qualified best. Life is a qualified best. It's first in shares. And the ones that it's tied with, it has the highest percentage. So, it is not beaten by anything in both shares and percentage tied or beaten I guess would be a, an even more accurate way to put it it's not tied or beaten by anything in both shares and percentage so it gets a first and guess is life and I guess we're going to put it in quotes for a little margin of search friendliness now, right after that, right after that, ha ha, right after that is right. And it is beaten only by life. This here is descending order of shares. And as we go down this descending order of shares, right is only beaten by life. Tied or beaten by life in both shares and percentage. So it gets a second. Second right to bear arms, right? People is beaten by both right and life. So it gets a third. And by the way, second placers are called silver medalists. Third placers are called bronze medalists. Third people. Is there anything like third world? Uh, so after people come show. Show is beaten by all of these guys, all three of these guys. So show gets a fourth place ribbon. And view is yet again beaten by all of these guys. One, two, three, four is beaten by four. It is fifth in the series. So view gets the fifth place ribbon. View gets the fifth place ribbon. And uh, nobody cares about, since we're only taking it down to the fifth place ribbon, by virtue of the fact that we have over 500 guesses. Uh, I, like to, I like to find a moment to figure out down to fourth place ribbons once we get to 400. I card out the qualified medalists down to bronze once we get to 300. And uh, I suppose you get the idea. Um, so going to the other direction, once we get to about 600, um, if I'm up to it, it'd be nice to figure it out down to the sixth place ribbon. So there we are, fifth for view. And where should we put our cursor? Maybe like here for now. So you have to get at least a 10.73. One thing we know now is you have to get at least a 10.73 
for us to talk about you as a potential uh, medalist or ribbonist of a note as being a noteworthy guess. So 10.7 down, down, even 19. There's our next one to, to be thinking about. 19 is only beaten by life. So love is a silver medalist. Music is beaten by love and life. So music is a bronze medalist. Okay. History right here is beaten by the two immediately above it plus life. And I'm doing this on my fingers. I've got three fingers sticking out at this point. So I take those three fingers, then I add the guess of the moment, and that means that we're talking about a fourth place ribbon for history. And I guess it's a damn shame that I lose my cursor as I go to the other side. I lose the, my place a little bit. But anyways, down here, wait, we did, just did history, so that's where we are now. We take a nice jump to 21.65, and it's a very narrow loss to life, isn't it? That's the only one that beats it, and it's quite narrow. The mystery is spiral, so we almost got a gold for a watch. A gold watch! <laughs> um, it's a uh, silver medalist. Silver medalist for watch. And um, an image feels really low, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All kinds of things beat, beat uh, image. Well, what are we looking for now? We got one in the 20s, 20s. I'm holding up my fingers. 19, 19 is four. Looks like 18.96. We have to we have to get to at least 18.96. It looks like to me above 1896 before we'll even think about it for any guess. That puts a bunch of these out. Travel, I know, is a gold medalist. Uh, cause one thing is that, well, the gold medalists are already settled. I know my gold medalists. And, um, and in fact, I want to show you them right now. Here are the gold medalists. Um, in a somewhat different form without the uh, search friendly quotes and with the guessers beside the names and I wonder can you pick out the rather extraordinary um, statistical improbability in this list you might think Libby 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 is the one to look at massive star galaxy cluster supernova remnant but that sort of thing is not really so unusual um, I suppose it's unusual that Miss Markey is tied for uh, first in the number of times that a name appears because uh, Miss Markey does not. Well, Miss Markey does not have a reputation when it comes to solving mysteries. I've never looked very deeply um, into how she typically does in the qualified best, but you'd think normally that a person who doesn't solve a whole lot probably is not going to be strong in other categories. A person can be surprised. A person looks can look through statistics and be surprised at times. But you, I wouldn't think offhand that um, she that this is um, something that she normally does or that she does especially well at. But she does have three um, listings here, including the two on the bottom. The two on the bottom means that she has the two qualified best that are lowest in shares. Lowest in shares, highest in percentage. But what's really cool is that the team in its current construction has a grand total of eight guessers and seven of them. Seven of them. Count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Are you seeing a name being repeated? I don't. 
Harbley, Gray Flank, Aber, Peter, Jules, Miss Markey, Francis, and SA, Libra Romana. This is seven eighths of the team, and they are and they are represented once and only once. Um, in the uh, as being holders of qualified bests with the most shares, the seven qualified bests with the most shares have attached to their to have attached to them screen names of guessers of seven eighths of the team's guessers appearing once and only once. The one person not on this list is Woody. Woody S. Yes. And uh, like that, uh, yes, statistical probability. There are eight. This is one for you. You, I'm not a math guy, really. I, I like kind of like numbers. I haven't advanced all that far in them, but it certainly it certainly hits me intuitively as a as long odds. Take a team of eight players, and we'll assume now that they're equal in. I don't know what they're equal in. How often they guess? Assume they're equal. Eight players. You have a pool of eight players. And uh, what are the chances that? Um, I guess we have to assume they're equal in how often they guess. How and how, what kind of quality of player they are too. Um. Uh. Eight players, and seven of them. Seven of them have their names listed in the first seven qualified bests by shares. Anyhow, I think that is striking. Striking. And they're not equally awful. There is some um, some of a bit of an impression that some players are in fact better than others. Okay, we had to. We know that online we're not going to care about, and I also know from from the past, um, if not by other means, that um, story is a qualified best. So that's a first. Uh, you know that one's out, and then film is only beaten by story. Okay, you get second place for film, silver medalist. And um, I guess we got to think about review. One, two, three, twenty-one oh four. It looks like it just misses, doesn't it? There's the two twenty-ones. Both of the twenty-ones are higher. The two twenty-ones. We kick it up to travel, and my I'm marking it with my fingers again. One once again. Four finger, middle finger, ring finger each in their turn. We have the two twenty ones, we have travel. We have the new big one, story and film, so review doesn't work. Review's out of the money. You have to do better than that. Twenty six point forty nine, knowing that travel is a qualified best, um, we only have to begin our search there and see that story and film beats it and that's it so special gets a third special gets a bronze with spiral the SPs game is beaten by the same two that beat special so game as well and there's the football spiral pass throwing perfect spirals might have something to do with this although you know what I looked up football which I guess can mean soccer as much or more hard to tell interesting question to my mind uh, football does not actually do well game does football doesn't really it's not it's not enough um, that sense of the word spiral is not enough to make football, t especially high scorer. So, okay, third place uh, bronze medalist for game. It's at 28. Entertainment suddenly doesn't look so hot, does it? 
No, no, it, no. The it, interchange is 25, but it's beaten by the two immediately above it. No, I guess we're in, aren't we? It's beaten by the two immediately above it. It's beaten by film and story. That's four fingers. No, entertainment's in. Entertainment is part of our reason for being here because, um, well, I keep the team up on qualified bests and also when it was current, when it was the big latest thing, I did them up through um, uh, bronzes. So I guess there's the outside chance that entertainment would be a guess that um, we didn't knew we didn't know it was a a big one in this category. Actually, I think it was. I think it was a bronze back in the day. But certainly, um, as far as new guesses between then and now, it could be a scoop to um, find out that something is a fourth or fifth place ribbon. Okay. After entertainment, we do movie. Movie's only beaten by story. So second placer for movie. Movie wasn't first a long time. Opening, beaten by the one immediately above it, as well as story, and that's it. That's the entire story, right? Bronze medalist for opening. I still have not figured out the source of guesses of this nature doing so well that are high in shares. I'm, th I'm thinking a rogue website, but I haven't found it. Okay. Third for opening. And at this point, well, 25 was right on the border last time, wasn't it? So we know that those two aren't in. We also know this is a huge jump, of course. First place gold medalist for television. And we get some very funky looking figures in a short period of time, especially when you look at the drop off that follows. It's going to follow this, this very quick uh, list of a bunch of spikes. So first for television. Well, can we think about stars? How significant is the 30s? One for story, two for movie, three for opening, four for television. The worst of the bunch of stars, but it's the end. It's a, it's a ribbon. And it's so obvious because there's stars in the sense of television stars, and there's then there's stars in the sense of outer space. We really haven't gotten to that yet. We haven't gotten to the outer space uh, flavor, but lower but lower in shares we found consistently high percentage scores in the outer space theme, though not not big shares guesses especially. But, but anyways, a person can imagine that the fifth in stars might be partially due to stars as kind of a bland word or movie stars. Since television star says that partly for its connection to planets and the solar system and such. Fifth for stars. Holding up the rear. You have to go at least to 30 to be con talked about. Trailer, as in a movie trailer trailer trash conceivably but pretty sure it's about movie trailers television trailers video is a uh, silver medal and then the big whopping first for premiere ought to be a huge clue of what the rogue website might be I'm thinking it might be something like Spiral Productions, such thing as Spiral Productions way in the, at the bottom of a web page somewhere, something like that. It appears on all whole bunch of different um, pages of the same site, but I haven't found it. I have not found the thing. 
And it doesn't help that Deeper Web only shows you 100, no matter how many uh, shares that it claims for a combination of terms, it'll only show you the first 100. And it'll show you their idea of relevance. And it's not a guessing game idea of relevance. So it's it's been I have not found usually I have better luck. Maybe if I go to, I've been thinking maybe if I go to Google, to, even though we're using the deeper web search engine, I might have better luck identifying uh, the source of all these high scorers, the rogue source of all these high scorers, if that's how it's happening. Um, I might have better luck at Google than Deeper Web. It's an idea, anyways. It's, it's a thought. And Jules W. Uh, might, in a roundabout way, be vindicated uh, for the fact she she has actually admitted that she does not. That even though we use Deeper Web, she doesn't. She plays the guessing game with Google. She plays the deeper web guessing game with a Google search engine. And uh, she's, um, she's known as the walking hall of famer for how many times she's solved mysteries and, and, and else and otherwise um, dominating the record book. But she doesn't really have a lot of solves lately since making, and we used to, and we used to play on Google she still is playing on Google. I, I think it's it's probably cutting into her solves lately. That we've, you know, hello, we've moved from Google to Deeper Web, and she's still using the Google search engine. Anyhow, so how, how low do we have to go? We have to go to at least the 30s somewhere. So I know not to bother with, we don't have to bother, can we put it here? We don't have to bother with color or sun or model. Maybe a little surprise that we don't have to color bother with sun, but we don't. Because um, outer space does very well, extremely well, at a lower level of shares. Concentrated uses is um, relating to spiral galaxies, but these are but it's not. These are not big share terms. Okay. We don't have to bother with model or light or ET, extraterrestrial, or release. I want to run right through this one more time. Release, space, picture, book, face, everything, gas, death. Actually, I think I'd be better off going here. I'd rather be off a little bit looking. I'd rather look at my numbers not boxed in. Character. Is clearly pretty high. To one, two, three, the three in the sixties, but we only have at least two up there. Yeah, so character doesn't make it. Looks like we have to be at least at thirty-three. So huge drop off in percentages. So we got we have some funkiness in the uh, structure of the list because normally uh, percentages climb as shares go down, or you start to see some spiky percentages as shares go down. But here we had this huge spiking area from what we were used to: two in the 60s, one in the 140s, three fifths above 60. And we're going to, and so now we're dropping to less than half of that. We're going through this huge, huge period with less than half of that. And that's not natural at all. Um, and, you know, especially when there's rogue sites involved, where uh, one particular website can have this an inordinate bearing on, in the entire universe, one, ex, one single website has... Huge can have a huge bearing on scores if it's you know if your mystery is a, a tag or your mystery is referenced on 500 pages out of 500 on this website because it's it's in a key location 
the term is using a key location or the tag is. Uh, you get some very funky um, structures such as this. It's a, it's a sign of a rogue site. So we keep going now. We keep scrolling. We're looking for something at least at 33. At least 33 we'll, before we'll think about it. And so what do we have? 55 for screening. So that would be, that's plain enough, I think. This is, um, uh, it's beaten by the three-fifths, right? It's beaten by the 140 and the 260s. So screening is a fourth place ribbon. Okay, premiere and screening there, those are two words that go together. So we can go down, I think we're dipping down to 36 or 39 now. It is the lowest number that we uh, need to care about as we scroll down, down, down. 3330 is not going to cut it. Um, 36 or 39, which of those is it? Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Have I gone too fast for my own good? Have I missed anything? It does not appear so. Dust is good, but not that good. Dust, dust actually does fine in some of my measures. Some of my measures kind of account for the craziness. So, I mean, dust, dust in its um, neighborhood is quite strong. It's not, it's not freaky. It's not in the freaky zone structurally. Um, but it is great for who it hangs out with. And I do have some measures that bring out dust as an all-star. Um, dust spirals. Okay. And so anyways, there's that one. We're still looking for something like 36, 39. It's the only one we have to, it's as low as we need to go. Or minimum of, of, of how high we need to go before I need to do some scribbling. Oh, so I'm starting to see some, you see that? Maybe a little bit of spiking, considering. If we consider those numbers in the 60s and the 140s, aberrations. Maybe you do take out those, and maybe you're starting to see just a little bit of a tendency upward, although that three out of four does not speak to a tendency upward. 36 or 39, beam's pretty good. 36 to 39 or so, something like that in that neighborhood. 36 to 39, and on and on and on. It's just endless. It's endless. Total aberration in that five slot. Um, you know what? Those are probably the terms I should look for. It's a huge sign that those particular three are um, attached to the rogue site. I don't know if I had um, considered that so carefully before. Probably screening, too. I don't know about screening. Certainly those other three should belong to the rogue site. If there's if there's such a thing that should bring them out, plug in those three at Google with spiral, or plug in those three without spiral and see if spiral accidentally shows up. That could be another way to work it. And the spiral show up on its own once you plug in the other three terms. So we're looking for something like 36, 39. Astronomy is great, and of course the theme, way way down with the high percentages. Is astronomy dominated? But even but astronomy is not that not that high in shares when it's um, when it's standing up next to um, the apparent rogue website. So we're still looking for something like 36, 39. I'm going to do another eyeball to see if I possibly missed something. If I had possibly been going scrolling too fast for my own good, it does not appear so. Oh, there's a spiker that looks totally unnatural, and yet it actually fits very nicely. Galactic, 
we're looking for spiral galaxy. So that's extremely, galactic is extremely close, and it's on the, the essential theme um, that um, is really the only theme that we've been able to trust. We've been able to get occasional high scorers in this television movie premiere screening stuff, but there's been a lot of turkeys too that would seem to be related and um, and don't do well. But when we guess astronomy, we don't get high overalls, we don't get high shares, but boy, we are consistent in getting high percentages. Um, so anyways, we know that uh, Premier is the only one. Premier is the only other time we have seen something over 100. So Galactic ought to be a goal, of course, but in a perfect world. But the Rogue's website and Premier holds it down to silver. So Galactic, the silver medalist, where are we now? I think we have to beat 55 now, don't we? We have the, the clump of three, the 140 and the 260s. We have the odd screening showing up down the list. And now we have Galactic. So we're not even going to consider you unless you're up at 55. And with that in mind, the huge... Um, ah huge jumping burden so it's, it's actually not very far down below that we find another member right we had we required a suddenly we're re re requiring for guests to be much stronger in percentage before we even think about them and as fast as that jump was is not very far at all before we meet another qualifier is beaten by the 200s, the two in the hundreds, but it's stronger than the 60s, so we're looking at a bronze with the telescope. Third for telescope. A couple hundreds and 80 and two 60s, right? What's the lower of the 60s at 63? So we don't need to even think about it until we see something at 63. Don't even need to think about it until you see a guess up around 63. And I think the eyeballs are starting to see that we're starting to see 30s more often, which is what happens in a normal world. Percentages, the higher percentages, um, creeping upward as you go down lower in shares planets orbit good in most worlds aren't they but not uh, here especially we need to get to at least 63 50 is nice isn't it it's not 63 though okay 63 there's a nice little spike um, some bad news. Three out of four. Whoa! Look at that bad news. Four out of five below ten, and the other one just barely five in a row at uh, whatever it does it mean, if anything, uh, below eleven. Oh, some more bad news. Well, stars look like it means something, doesn't it? Can that be by chance? That is awfully damn low. Six out of eight below ten. Seventh out of eight below eleven. Awfully damn low. Wow. We're looking for something of uh, at least 63. Seems to me the astrophysics very nice, and you know what makes it without without the rogue sight, the absence of the rogue sight. Astrophysics would be getting its name up in lights, but the rogue sight obscures a lot of these qualified best. Oh, I'm seeing something! Boom. And a theme all by itself that we really have not developed. If there is a theme to attach to it, I'm, we really haven't found a way to attack it. We haven't really found a way to find related terms. 
And I happen to know that the word is experience, even though you only see EX there. And you probably would, would have known that too, right? Near death X, if you were given that on Wheel of Fortune, I think you can solve the puzzle. All right, so we've got a gold medalist for near death experience. So let's review where we are. We've got three in the hundreds. We have an 80. My fingers are at, at um, my fingers at four right now. Um, but the higher the other one's like 69. So we're not gonna or 66. You gotta be above 66 for us to uh, give it a hoot. Let's see. We have three in the hundreds. The fourth is 80. So, well, okay, you can be below 80 at fifth. Below, okay, yeah, 66, 66, 66. I think I'm more comfortable with my cursor here. I don't want to. I don't want to see these numbers box as they scroll up. That doesn't actually help me. It's easy to miss them. Get obscured by the box, by the lines. The uh, Milky Way is the next one we care about. So it is beaten by the 180, the 140, the 100. It beats the 80 in turn. It is a fourth place ribbon. Okay. We have a fourth place ribbon for the Milky Way. Near death, screening, galactic. Those are the three. Those are the hundreds. Milky Way is fourth in the 90s, and now we have to beat 80. We don't care unless you can get past 80 at this point. And with that in mind, what do we see? Do we set to hook the hop? Oh, luminosity. Oh, whoa. So I think it was, um, I think it was just a flat 80, wasn't it? Was that um, astronomy? Luminosity and astronomy. Let's see if we can um, do this fairly painlessly. Astronomy. Come on, dude. No, I don't want radio astronomy. No, 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 no. I don't want x-ray astronomy. I just want freaking astronomy. No, 32? 32, it wasn't astronomy? Oh, dearie, dear me. Was it astrophysics? Or wasn't that just a, five, a 50? What am I confusing it with? The astrophysics was a 50. What was the 80? Ah, oh, geez. Well, let's just try to remember that, that luminosity is the one that we are um, all fired up about. Telescope. Well, you know what? There, right? Telescope. That could have cued me. If I could have looked, looked at my, um, look at the work I'd already done, that might have cued me the telescope was the big one that I was looking for. Okay, so telescope is at... 82.44. That's our bottom. That's our. That's the barrier. That's the threshold that we have to clear if we're going to uh, enjoy uh, fifth place Ribbon Hood, which is awful close to Robin Hood. I feel like that was half on purpose. I won't take. I won't take credit for the other half. Okay, luminosity. Does luminosity, having a hard time holding this in my head, does luminosity beat the 82.44? And why aren't we on the same scale here? Nope, it doesn't. It does not beat 82.44. It's 82.05. Shit out of luck. That's what that's called. Shit out of luck for luminosity narrowly losing to um, <sighs> narrowly out of the ribbons um, to telescope. 
but I think that is logical. Don't feel too bad about that. As far as helping the helping the guessers solve the mystery, I don't think you want luminosity to be faring better or equal to telescope. Okay, so um, 82, so now I think we're quite clear about this. 82.44 was the barrier. So I st let's still not, let's not guess anything too close to it. So my obsessive self is not going to trust my 82.44 uh, memory and I'll have to look at, all, at it all over again. <clears throat> 82.44. And dark matter is rather nice, but this is a new world. And 63 doesn't cut it anymore. We are looking for 82.44. Some other nice fat ones that would have meant something at another time. 82.44 is what we're talking about here. 82.44. And I slow down in case I've been scrolling too fast. And oh, horrid, horrible, horrible, horrible. And great, 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 great. So where are we now? Um, we have the 180, we have the 140. Redshift is, high, is a higher 100 than uh, Galactic had been. So, that's still the story. Redshift is a third place ribbon. And of course, when I do it manually, it's possible to make mistakes. Another reason that I would love to Love to learn an automated process for the qualified best. Please send me your comments, or put. Please send me in the, uh, the comment section what I need to do, or email me at. Uh, and I guess the capitals don't actually matter. Monstrous Walker at uh, hotmail.com. Oopsie Daisy. That was exactly what I didn't want. Monstrous Walker at hotmail.com. If you would like to uh, make it a dissertation to explain to me uh, an automated process using Excel non-commercial use um, how I should run the qualified best <sighs> guesses that are not tied or beaten by any other guess in both percentage and shares monstrous walker at hotmail.com so Bum, 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 bum. Redshift got a bronze medalist. And um, so what's the burden now? The 90? We had one in the 90s, didn't we? We have the 180, the 140. Get the fingers going again. We have two in the hundreds and the aughts. And um, then there's the 90. So we have to beat 90, and there's a good one. Hutt's Hubble Space Telescope, I happen to know. And um, so the 180 and the 140, and boom, the 132. And this is a bit of a curiosity to me. Let's see, Hubble, let's fill this one out. Hubble Space Telescope. It's a curiosity to me that you drop just two marks in um, shares two tiny drops in, in shares and who knows what what kind of represent what kind of drop it actually represents and um, you're jumping what looks like kind of cosmetically a rather large jump in percentage but they're on the same yeah you know, they're on the very same plane in uh, besthood I just think it's kind of interesting so where are we now we got the 180 we got the 140 we got the 130 and two in the aughts. So you have to be in the aughts 
And in fact, I believe that uh, I'm pretty sure that Galactic was at 104. 104 is the new minimum. And of course, well, that makes the world so much easier. All you now we're looking for five digits. We're looking for a big bully in a number of digits. I can just, I should I should be able to just fly through this now, right? Big bully in number of digits. How do you miss that? You can get a little bit more ballsy about scrolling fast because we're looking for just a big old bully. 216 massive star. Woohoo! I want to do it. I want to do it. I just want to go back, back, back. Couple space telescope, and flying, 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 flying. Two hundred and sixteen massive star. Yeah, I learned that massive star was guessed earlier today. In fact, it is. It was. I found out it was the first qualified best that the team had had in 164 guesses and the streak is we have another streak of unknown quantity obviously more guesses since we had what is called a transcendent qualified best a transcendent qual there we have two kinds of qualified best one is the transcendent qualified best um, that um, kicks out a now former qualified best on its way in, breaks new ground. So, I mean, if we had something um, later on in the day that uh, tomorrow or whenever that fit, that came up, finished higher than Massive Star on the uh, shares scroll, while at the same time a higher percentage, then Massive Star would no longer be a qualified best, and a new guest would come in. That new guest, should it happen, I mean, this cur cursor here is annoying, I'm not sure. It annoys me, that's enough, I guess. Um, the, uh, the new best that comes in would be called a transcendent qualified best for kicking out Massive Star on its way in. So there's there's transcendent qualified best, and then there are bests that enter peacefully. <laughs> this is my stock term for them is that they enter peacefully. They uh, extend the list of qualified bests without transcending. They fit they fit snugly onto an expanded list of qualified bests, but um, don't actually break new ground. Do not go to a higher plane. Um, so Massive Star entered the list and expanded the list from 10 to 11. It was not transcendent, however, and so um, it's been even longer, maybe substantially longer than 164 guesses since we had a transcendent qualified best. So, there's that. We have the, uh, the 216. We have the 180. We have the, well, we have the 140 and the 130, right? 216, 180, 140, 130, and the 109. 109 would be our bare minimum. That would mean that radio astronomy does make it at the fifth place level. Boy, are we really talking about ribbons on 100? 216, 180, 140, 130. This is Hubble Space Telescope. 109, 115, 113. It's in the fifth. It makes it barely. That's radio astronomy. Fifth place ribbon. So 11310 is the new minimum. 228. Boom. And here's boom boom. Kind of makes you feel like, well, who cares? It's par for the course now to get to 200. It's not really true, but it kind of looks that way. Um 
Galaxy Clusters is a first place ribbon, for, excuse me, a gold medalist. Galaxy Clusters. And then right after that is a first for Supernova. Can you, if you're playing Will of Fortune, can you figure this one out? Remnant. Galaxy Clusters and Supernova Remnant are both boom, excuse me, and boom, gold medalists. So we got to take stock of our situation. Where are we suddenly? Supernova at 260, Galaxy Clusters at 220, Massive Star at um, 216. Uh, near death at 180, and a rather large drop off from that point, right, to um, Premier from way, way, way back then at 140 or in the 140s. So we do not care unless you are in the 140s. We don't give a <clears throat> fiddler's fart. That's from Ath Angela's Ashes. If you are not in at least the 140s. And so we begin our scroll. Scroll, scroll, scroll. The long slog. The long process. The long opposite of automated manual process. The long, long scroll. That I wish didn't have to be so long, although this is, you know what, when you have to work and use your own brain, you do learn more, you pick up more. And so there will always be that compensation. Learning the list better, appreciating getting, you know, you put more into the game, you get more out of it, that sort of thing. I can't be too upset over the fact that I have this process to, that I have to go through. So we, anyways, we're at 140 is what we're looking for. We do another eyeballing to make sure we haven't been going too fast. 142 for XMM Newton. Hoodly, heedly, hodly, who? And uh, pretty darn sure the premiere is higher than that and that uh, XMM does not make it. But this time I can do this with confidence. I think I can do this with confidence and not lose a lot of time. And I'd like to learn this process a little bit better. Is 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 the problem has the wait a second. Has the problem been all along that I have not had the cursor there? Control find. Now will we stay will we stay on the same level? And so I don't have to do a lot of toggling, toggling back and forth, toggling to the right or left. Let's find out. We want at this point, and we're going to come back down to XMM. 142, back down to XMM. Premier, darn it. Well, we have to do that. No, it doesn't work. It does not work for me. It's like, where the hell are we now? Where the hell are we? There's Premier. That was awful. Um, no, no, okay. Premier is the lowest 140 you can be. No, what? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. There's that. There's the crazy high bunch of them. The crazy high five. Hmm. High five. So that was Premier. Maybe if we kept it on the guest number? Do we stay on the same plane? So anyways, you knew it was in the straight 140s. 140, 14 aught. And then XMM. You know there hasn't been another XMM. Well, that kept me on the same plane. Except that where I really want to be is back here. 142. So yeah, it's actually in. It's narrowly in. Fifth place ribbon for XMM Newton. 
kind of cool okay 142 is the new minimum and we look and things are getting populated things are getting not so rare to see what used to be a huge number um, well it's making a huge jump isn't it at a Karine, this is a this is from about the last day or so this at a Karine business um, well, it's behind. It's the fifth place ribbon, isn't it? It's on the same plane as XMM Newton. Because we jump, we fall all the way down from 180 near death experience. So, 168 looks significantly higher, but it's only on an equal plane. So, that is also a fifth place ribbon for Eta Karine. Eta Karine. Fifth place ribbon. Bunch of uh, astronomy stuff, <laughs> basically. A, a set of two stars. A mini solar system that has two stars in it or a mini maxi solar system one solar system is one star two suns one unit with two one unit with two stars in it will double what a solar system is at a Karen a if I remember it right so 168 represents the new bottom the new minimum 168, 273, and I know from another source that that is a qualified best, Galaxy Zoo, where is that places, can we even keep track of it anymore, a 270, a 260, 220 a 210 and the 180 so near-death experience at 180 whatever it was is the new minimum 180 for near boom whoa, 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 whoa. there's the other miss Marky guess ghost stalkers and no one has any idea why no one has been able to find anything else. No one who has, who has incorporated ghost stalkers in their thinking, I'm pretty sure, has ever found another um, especially good guess. I wonder about Empire. Maybe Empire. Which um, kind of does it in shares. Who knows? Hard to say. 400, where are we now? We have a 400. We have a, was it a 270? Yes. Yes, we, yeah, Galaxy Zoo and Ghost Suckers. Yeah, yeah, I want to talk about same plane. That's pretty wild, isn't it? They're not far at all, part, or not very far apart at all in shares. Um, what looks like a massive difference in percentage but same plane, first and first, not told apart by this measure. Ghost stalkers. So Galaxy Zoo at 270 is number two. Um, we have the 260, whatever it was, the 220, whatever it was. And then we bring up the rear with 210 which was like oh yes 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 that was massive star so massive star at about 216 i think it was represents the new minimum 216 is the new minimum that means messier objects doesn't make it ha <laughs> ha woohoo we get excited about uh, the list gets excited about it makes it a, an elite in uh, percentages Qualified best doesn't think a whole lot of it. 
We're looking for a 216. We don't have to care unless you get to 216. That used to be nice in, in its day. We don't care about it now. That used to be nice in its day. Hey, you don't care about that one now. Wow. Really? Wow. Okay, and uh, so the 216 is what we're looking for. And of course, there are plenty of very bad guesses here because, you know, if a guess is not related, if a guess is not at all related, it will not do well. It doesn't have to. Uh, it can do even worse in percentage the further you go down in shares. But the flip side is also true. You have the potential to go much higher in percentage as you go down in shares. So the next one to uh, consider is this homunculus thing. Now, do I even know this one as playing Wheel of Fortune? Yes, I do, actually. Took me took me a moment to um, orient though, and I'm very fortunate that I can see I can see part of the B. Otherwise, I may not have been able to make it. But this homunculus, whatever it is, nebula, homunculus nebula, um, is the only guess in the uh, 300s exactly. We have one in the 400s. But what I'm saying is we used to have a drop off from the 400s to in, in the 200s. And now we don't. And now the cliff is not as sheer now that um, homunculus, homon, homon, not homo, homunculus nebula has been guessed. Now that that mouthful has been guessed, homunculus nebula and if you don't believe me ah there see I won Wheel of Fortune I won my Wheel of Fortune game um, something tells me I was in mid-sentence and when I can play this over we'll figure it out Okay, so where are we now? We have a 400, we have a 300. We have, isn't it the 270s? Come on, baby, tell me. 270s? 270s, 270s, 270s? What do we have here? Maybe I could get cued here. Galaxy Zoo is what? We have Ghost Stalkers. What is Galaxy Zoo? So 290? Oh, geez. Maybe it doesn't matter. I'm going to hold out that maybe it doesn't matter. Maybe it doesn't matter that I've forgotten because maybe we don't have to worry about anything else for the whole rest of the list. What we have to worry about is higher than 2. Well, you know what? I'm pretty sure that it's 228. Not going from the top down, but from fifth place up that we have to go to at least 228 now before I am going to give a fiddler's fart about anything. There we are on the bottom, so it didn't matter. We didn't have anything going lower. We didn't have anything both that uh, was strong and sh that was especially exciting in shares. Yes, down the bottom of zero in shares, we have our very worst guesses. We're in percentage. Coincidence, I think not. But you know what? If it had a single share, one itty-bitty share, there could have been a lot of potential to get a very high, freaky high scorer if there, it didn't go with many hits. Maybe, you know, one share, one hit. That's happened. One share, one hit has happened before. Um, is that a true statement? One share, one hit. I know that two shares, two hits has happened. I remember one of those offhand. And I do know about one share guesses being percentage champs. Not necessarily with one hit, but uh, being percentage champs on their list at a, at a late stage in the list. So here we are. We made it. We made it. We're not done. You're not at all, not by a long chalk, as Stephen King would have said. 
our as a New Englander representing all of New England um, not by a long shock are we done with this uh, process or what I'm going to present what I'm going to present to the people we're not done by any stretch of the imagination of the imagination but you knew what I meant uh, da, 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 da. yes okay so so far so good guessing and qualified best down to the fifth place ribbon guessing and qualified best what down to the fifth place ribbon now what we do is lots of fun we we link like with like this is gonna be great one two three four five and we link like with like with like so we cut here and we put love there and we get a clearer picture we get a clearer picture is what we get and a little cut and a little paste and what are we else going to do? And a little cut. And a little paste. Show and history on the same plane. Hmm. Show and history on the same plane. What does it all mean? love and watch on the same plane way up there I love to watch spirals you'd love to watch spirals too wouldn't you now this one's this one's extra fun you get to scoop up two at the same time and we cut and we learn nothing new because the qualified best are something that the full qualified best is already something we have at our fingertips but oh well fourth fifth so all beautiful 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 um, we're going to bring in film cut I love to watch film hmm love to watch film well if I get if I love it so much I'm hypnotized by it that it'll like send me into a brainwave spiral third for special oh, I feel very special SP come on SP you know what sometimes this stuff matters I haven't especially found it to matter in this mystery but there have been some onomatopoeic mysteries let me tell you and once in a while it is such that a computer you can figure you can imagine that a program a computer program could be constructed to solve the mystery just bait because to solve certain mysteries um, just on the basis of of the spellings of the most related terms when groovy or especially at a, at a certain stage there was an amazing a number of G and GR words and ooh, I think an ooh sounds was it? Let's see, we had what else was that? Goober. We had a mystery goober. Goober and the ghost chasers. I think it was. And um, we were unusually high in 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 long ooh sounds at the top of the list. There were a lot of ooh words. I think the same was true for Groovy but especially uh, the GRs there are a lot of high scoring GR words when the mystery was groovy oh this is kind of fun 
we can just close, close, close by backspacing rather than cutting. Isn't that nice? Okay. I wonder if we could scoop this one up. No, no, it's not fair. Okay. Um, what I was thinking. We can't scoop up both the second placer and the third placer because in the subsets, the subsets are supposed to be ordered from most to fewest shares. And isn't it special that film and movie are on the same plane and you wouldn't have ex you wouldn't have expected it to be in any other way, now would you? Let's can we have a lot of fun here? No, we can't have that much fun. Let's see now. This is about as much fun as we can have at the same time. Um in terms of scrolling down ahead of time. Cut. And we're going to create a space. And I am published by Create Space. That's the name of my self-publisher. They have that used to be Great Unpublished. Monstrous was originally published under the horribly named Great Unpublished. Great Unpublished became Book Surge. And Book Surge sold to Create Create Space. Or became Create Space, which is an imprint of Amazon. Amazon should actually be motivated, extra motivated to sell my book uh, on Amazon because they own Create Space, they own my publisher. We're all in bed together and it's all very messy, it would seem, or it's all very clean. Um, television. Where will this take us? Well, we know where it's going to take us, don't we? Cut. Or with little thought, we know where it's going to take us. It's going to take us to a familiar place. Television is a qualified best. Ooh, this one's fun. We don't have to do any cutting. We just backspace. And then with this one, we're going to cut. Trailer. Up we go. Movie trailer, logical. Film we like to love to watch movie film trailers, movie and film and movie trailers, right? You can construct a sentence very simply on the second placers. Look at this. Well, right. I know what we're going to do with how we're going to fit right into the sentence. I wasn't anticipating that I would need to fit r the word right into the sentence. Right wingers, right winger. Right angles. Yeah, I, I don't know how to I don't know how to do it. I don't know how to fold it in. But right love. Righteous. Righteous love? Right. Right on love. Right on I love to watch film and movie trailers about people, music, so spe special games, game openings and, and shows and opening shows and game shows okay well anyways and this is all supposed to lead me to think about spirals I don't think so but a lot of this a lot of these big ones are up here because of the uh, presumed rogue site and it could be anything on the rogue site it doesn't have to be a television show or movie. It could be some kind of, it could be anything. <laughs> there's a, there's a site computer world. Once upon a time, our mystery was floundering or actually flounder. And I was accepting, no, yeah, I was accepting flounder. I was accepting the infinitive, but what I was looking up was floundering. The mystery was floundering and a website called Computer World was inordinately responsible for floundering scoring well because of a column called Floundering Users. <laughs> floundering Users of Computer. We're having problems with our computer. Can you please help us? We are floundering. So Computer World has had a column called Floundering Users and there would be this tendency of computer terms, um, technical computer kind of terms, 
things that you'd expect to see on a, on a page of that nature, scoring well. They were all scoring extremely well with the word floundering. <laughs> so it doesn't have, if there's a rogue site, it doesn't have to be intuitively related. Very often isn't. Very often there's a confusion between meaning and proximity. Uh, and we have ways to combat this problem. I have developed some measures that combat this problem. So glory to the game. It, do, it doesn't break us. It doesn't break our balls. To um, have these issues, it, it increases. It just, well, it just adds to the challenge. It adds to the challenge, but we can negotiate this challenge. Um... Copy. No, cut, cut, cut. Screening. Okay. Don't know how that fit that into a sentence. Galactic. Cut. Deedly do. Certainly the highest shares of its theme. Third for telescope. Going to cut. Of course we are. You knew that. Don't know how to fit you into the conversation. Near death experience. It kind of it seems to me there ought to be a way. Um, is ought one and ought two and all that stuff spelled differently or the same as ought is not to be a way but there ought to be a way to capitalize on near-death experience scoring well because things that I intuitively, when we get something that's vaguely related to, seems vaguely relatable to near-death experience, they do end up scoring well. But we have not, we have not found a systematic way to um, find guesses related to near-death experience that can be counted on to score well. We have not, we have not found, we have not found a way. Period to um, take advantage of this particular guess. Cut for the Milky Way. And it's a fourth, right? So down in here. Fun stuff. Scoop up two at a time. Cut. Tack them to the bottom of the thirds because they are lower in shares than the ones that are higher in the thirds. But the ones lower in the thirds are also higher than in percentage than the ones that are higher in the thirds. And that goes for all the other numbers. Massive star, yes, yes, yes. Cut. The newest qualified best, newest member of the qualified best, gets folded in to our expanded look down through the fifth place ribbon. Radio, maybe we can scoop up a few more of these at one time. Is that the end of the list? Everything's a fifth or a first except for the homunculus nebula at the very end. That's interesting. Seven in a row that are either fifths or firsts. See, I, I have an eye for this sort of thing. I have an eye for the freak show. Cut. Oh, you know what? This should have been a classic. Um, well, I've already gone through the cut. I've already done it. I could have had the pleasure of backspacing, though. Of course, a lot of that backspacing, you don't want to. You don't want to cut into the uh, 
into the word and then forget where you are. So now we scoop back at two. This is his own pleasure. Cut. And what? Near the experience, mass and star did not fall in the right place. Well, okay, let's do this. Let's, it's okay. It's going to be okay. It'll be interesting to see what happened there that screwed me up. But all these guys, and I can't. I do know these are in the right space. These get these guys need to get cut, and they need to fit here. Huh. All right. Be that way. Huh. And I'm not going to have another second. Well, I do have another second. Okay, let's keep that space open. It'll be this will be its own pleasure. Cut into a space that doesn't need creating. So bunch of fifths. Oh, okay, now it gets going to be frightening though. We get to backspace, 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 backspace. But it's sometimes going to get frightening if we jump into someone else's territory. Okay, there we are. Fifth, fifth, fifth. A couple more firsts. Cut. So we're no remnant. Boom. If I did this right, there'll be 11 firsts. 11 different members of the qualified best. I got to 11. Can you do it twice in a row? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Galaxy Zoo. Stalkers is 11. Second, second, seconds. Space. But we have something ready to go into that space, don't we? Fourth, 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 fifth, fifth, fifth. There it is. So, we our own kind of special pleasure that we're going to cut. But unlike all those other times, because Friday is Spice of Life, we have a ready-made hole to drop it into. And that's that. Now, I think for a little clarity, I am a, actually, after all of this, for a little clarity, I am a fan of separating gold medalists from silver medalists from bronze medalists from fourth place ribbons and fifth place ribbons and so we've done it we scoop up the whole thing however for all this scooping copy did I copy I think I did did I copy for all this scooping um, I cannot go through with the paste if there have been new guesses because I want this to be absolutely accurate so we could have a little bit of a complication if uh, I have fresh, if in the first place I have fresh guesses, and then, uh, but nope, nope, we're going to be all right. There's been zero new messages. If I had to, like, recalculate things partially, at least in part, it looks like I'm just fine. Talk about repeats, the most recent thing, three hours ago. There hasn't been another fresh guess. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Reply. Nice little feature to help them out. There they are. All their beauty. Wouldn't it be just the funniest thing in the world if somehow the word spiral got into this for some, like, some crazy reason the word spiral is on this somewhere, but it's not. And... Um, Q scores, what they're called. Q scores. Q 
Q scores down to the fifth place ribbon. Qualified Qualified Bests Qualified Bests Silver Medalists Maybe I should do it like this. First, first qualified best. Or is this confusing? Second, first equals. How about first? First equals as if, as if has qualified best been guessed and it was a qualified best? What a coincidence. Second equals, first equals qualified best. Second equals, I don't think, I don't see what the plural does for me here. The way that I'm exp expressing it. First equals qualified best. Second equals silver medalist. Third equals bronze medalist. Fourth equals fourth place ribbon. Don't know if there's anything that can be left and said. Fifth equals fifth place ribbon. Q scores down to the fifth place ribbon. Qualified best. Previously defined, outclassed, outclassed by, outclassed by one guess. Tied, tied, or out, tied or outclassed by one guess. Tied or outclassed by one guess. It should be and or. And zero some percentage. I've never defined it before in terms of I've never talked about the tie possibility really. Like a, like this is like technically a slight fraction um, shy of the, of the full truth. Qualified best first. He was qualified best. Tied, tied or beaten. I or beat my no other guess in both percent. Tied or beaten? Tied or beaten by no, by no guesses in both shares and percentage. Beaten by no guess. Okay. First, he was qualified best. Not beaten. In both shares. Not beaten. Not beaten by any other guess.
Not beaten, not tied or beaten by any of the guests. Ah! I'm carding out a new meaning here. Yep, I'm going to the edge of the line. I don't want that. Not tied or beaten. As I caught it out, a new definition. First, it was qualified vest, which we should know what it means. It's explained earlier. First, it was qualified vest. Second, equals silver medalist. Medalist outclassed by one guess in shares and percentage. Outclass by exactly one guess in shares and percentage. Outclassed by two guesses. We'll we'll we'll, we'll leave more instead as we every time we go down. Outclass exactly one guess in shares and percentage. Well, shares and percentage. Outclassed by exactly two guesses. Outclassed by three guesses. Outclassed by four. <laughs> two guesses. Uh, three guesses. Oh, class by four. Yes, indeedy, down drops. There they are, there they are, there they are, there they are. We have never done it before. Kind of a fun deal. After all that time, did I just give myself more work to do? Someone to suddenly fold in? Or else I'll feel remiss that the players are that somebody out there is working with less information than everybody else because someone has just made a guess while I was doing this. I sure did spend a lot of time, and my people they love the game, but they're not they're not pushing me at the moment. All right. Well, yes, you go through all a bunch of work. You go through a loving process where you find interesting things along the way. You get a interesting look at things like radio astronomy. Look at that. Two eyes and radio astronomy. See, that's part of what happens when you type. Rather than be automatic here, or just copying the words. And of course, this could get really crazy, but I want to change this as quite quickly as possible. And if I catch something else, I will um, <laughs> go back. I'll go back and edit this thing ten different times. So so we are enjoying a job well done, which I guess I'm now looking with with a particular. Uh, critical eye that I wasn't actually looking with a moment ago to see that there are no other typos and it looks like I'm fine. So we have a new way of looking at things. View so this is all should be think we should all be thinking spiral at some point here. Hmm, spiral, spiral, spiral. Or with any luck, the uh, the guessers will now know, now have a feel for the kinds of guesses that are simply heartache to play on and focus on the ones that have not been heartaches, that have been less heartaches, the ones that have been more suggestive that they're on the right track, which means astronomy, etc., outer space, telescopes, supernovas, and galaxies, especially galaxies.
or was not put make too fine a point of the fact that so often let's see is it's true yeah we have a couple of top tens that uh, where galaxy is the only word that appears twice it's the only word that appears twice in the percentage top ten I think it was the only word that appeared twice in the percentage differential best worst top ten and uh, it was two it was and they weren't the same galaxy words either or where galac g-a-l-a -A, was a form of the, for the sounds g of the sound galac galaxy galactic two different words with the sound galactic in them that in percentage differentials than there were in, in percentage straight up and now we get two words with galaxy in them in um, the qualified best this is also the only case galaxy clusters remnant yeah so that's where you should be oriented galaxy spiral the sense is for gal for spiral galaxies that's the one that's the that's the one definition of spiral given off a uh, very clear scent so looking at stuff we haven't seen in a while hmm right love watch film movie trailers and they should probably know by now that that whole series is nothing but heartache and the only parts that's not heartache is galactic and homunculus nebula people music special game opening telescope redshift hubble space telescope hmm there are two telescopes on the bronze plane hmm there's nothing that appears twice in the uh, film and movie feels like it appears twice right love watch film movie awfully close to each other but not exactly the same words so the golds have two galaxies the telescope is lower so it's what the telescope sees is higher it's the galaxy that the gal telescope sees that is higher than the telescope itself hmm show history screening the milky way hmm show history screening the milky way hmm view entertainment stars radio astronomy xm newton eta karen a hmm maybe the general does better than the uh specific this is pretty freaked out and it's and it's at the fifth place ribbon the milky way is less freaked out isn't it i would say the milky way is less freaked out than these things we've never heard of these obscure things we've never heard of everyone knows about the milky way everybody you know even though the whole space telescope is three words i think we all know about the Hubble space telescope don't we we know about telescopes in general too that's quite a general no redshift doesn't necessarily fill that bill but it's the shortest word of them all short words tend to be general oh but then I what do you make of homunculus nebula unless it's just freaking close and of course galactic galactic and adjective this should be telling you something we don't have anything that's really higher than galactic well galaxy kazoo way down at that level there's a single word it's absolutely the highest scoring single word and it's like the only adjective on the list the clue is more than just noun and that leaves room for adjectives you sure haven't been guessing them though you sure haven't been doing enough adjective guessing to clarify if that might be the uh, the, the uh, meaning or usage that is giving off the scent if that's the part of speech giving off the scent humunculus uh, galactic 
Hmm, right, love. Watch me, will you? We are a galactic community. And usually there's fewer of everything else. Usually there's more qualified best than anything else. 11. Let's see how it goes this time. Usually it's a descending scale. 11 qualified best. 8. Um, silver medalists. The same 8. Bronzes, only four um, fourth place ribbons, and six fifth place ribbons. So what explains that phenomenon exactly? Leave it in the comment section below. Um, yeah, so parent thread, we've been goofing off. Someone could show up. This could be the big moment. We might see the word spiral. We freaked out our gourd. Ah, ah, ah. Well, you know what? I don't have to look at it, I don't think. A giraffe. Things I saw on, sh on a short drive this morning. Oh, that's very interesting. Talk about repeats. Old batch I just did. France, not Francis, but yes, it is Francis. Francis from South Africa. Oh, things I saw on a short drive this morning. A giraffe. Several types of buck. Sheep grazing on the side of a row of the road. Broken toilet seat in the middle of the road. I don't know how I missed hitting it. Truck parked in the road and driver talking to the local group of prostitutes. <laughs> huh? <laughs> the animals are doing okay the people less so and I suppose I should look at Megastar but I don't feel the intense burden to I guess I will sneak a look at this before bed or I quite likely will and um, spiral superstars megastar well we've also had massive star right you can see if it's on this if megastars on the same plane as massive star uh, that might be interesting be interesting if they're qualified best sitting right side by side next to each other and that would be quite interesting and I do, I do make it my burden to uh, go to print earlier than I might have. Usually, I wait for six guesses to roll in. But if I see something that seems to have potential to me, I will, I will look it up, and I will follow it up with going to print if it's a qualified best or. I can see that it will lead in something. Occasionally, guesses that um, are not qualified qualified best will lead in differentials or other measures involving that are combined with differentials, or what we call relativity, relativity measures. Um, Traditionals relative to percentages, percentages relative to traditionals, and differentials relative to traditionals. Those are the ones that I use. And those are the ones that can help us out with untangling rogue sites from every other source uh, driving scores. Um, and did we lose the mic? Did we lose the mic? It kind of felt like we lost the mic for a second. <laughs> We're probably okay. Anyways, I, I think I've blabbed long enough. I have this idea of getting a salad before bed and and um, what? Maybe enjoying some YouTube? Yes, I enjoy YouTube. I record on YouTube and I enjoy it. Oh, where are we going? This is where I wanted to go. How long have I been here? And what do we have on our blank notepad? We have a bunch of crap. 
But you know what? I safely posted, right? You saw, I saw that I safely posted. So, I don't need this anymore. That's pretty daring, isn't it? I don't need that anymore. I can go to... Um, I can go directly to book crossing if, if I ever care to look at it again. I don't need to, I don't need to fill my computer with this stuff. Blank page. What do you want to say besides bye bye? How do you spell bye bye? And uh, mm, like that. <laughs>